So if you're working with Microsoft Office files inside the Dropbox folder, then you get access to the Dropbox bags. So let's see what that means right over here. So let me just open up this Excel file right over here. And over here on the right side, you can see that there's a Dropbox bags. So if I were to click on this, you can see various options right here. So you have an option to share this Excel sheet with someone else. So you can actually share this with someone else right over here. And once they share it, they can edit. If you choose that, that they can edit it, they'll be able to open up the Excel sheet on their computer and edit it simultaneously with you. Right, so that's something they can do by using Dropbox Red as well. You can also copy the Dropbox link and then paste it out to actually share it out with different people right over here. You can see that the shared uh, link has been generated once I actually uh, click on copy Dropbox link. You can also add in comments by pressing comments right over here. So once you press comments, you can see that a new web browser will open up and it'll take you to the comment section where you can add and collaborate uh, with comments right over here. So you can see that it is opening up and I can see that it has loaded and now I can work around with the comments right over here. So I can say something like hello there and so forth right over here and post it out. So that's another option you have. So let me just close this out. I'm going to leave this. And over here, you'll be able to see that there's version history over here as well. So you want to access the version history of this file, you can simply click on it and it'll open up the browser and take you, take you to the version history page. So over here, you can see that there's version history is right over here. So you'll be able to restore out a previous file right over there, just like that from here. And you can access that file out right over there. So you can see that the text has been replaced. So I can just close it out, not gonna save this. So old file has been replaced right over here. So this one and the old file, as you can see, has been replaced just like that. So that is how you can use the Dropbox Baz and make use of its features right over here uh, in Dropbox folder. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.